Hello, my name is Erin. By default, in-text citations created with Microsoft Word's citation tool adopt the same font style as the body text. However, today's tutorial shows how to change the font style for citations to any font, size, or color you would like. First, we'll change the font style for all citations at once. Then we'll change the font style for individual citations. For a complete tutorial about citations, please see my previous video titled How to Insert Citations in Microsoft Word. Today I'll be using Word for Microsoft 365. These steps also apply to the one-time purchase versions of the software back to Word 2016. In addition, the steps will be similar in older versions of the software. We'll cover this topic in Word for Mac in an upcoming tutorial. Before we begin, it's very important to note that you should insert your citations into your document before performing these steps. If you add citations later, you'll have to repeat these steps because the new citations won't inherit the previously created font changes. To begin changing the font style for all citations, press Alt plus F9 on your keyboard to reveal your field codes. If you prefer not to use function keys, you can reveal your field codes by selecting the File tab, followed by Options in the Backstage view, and then selecting the Advanced tab in the Word Options dialog box. From there, select Show Field Codes instead of their values, and select the OK button. Once your field codes are revealed, Select the Home tab in the ribbon, and then select the Replace button in the Editing group. Type caret D citation into the Find What text box. Ensure that you have one space between the D and the word citation. Next, place your cursor in the Replace With text box, but be careful not to type anything. Now, select the More button to expand the dialog box, and then select the Format button, followed by Font from the drop-down menu. When the Find Font dialog box appears, select your new font, font style, size, and font color. You can also add an underline style and underline color if you'd like. When you're finished, select the OK button. Your new font choices should appear under the Replace With text box. Next, select the Replace All button. And then select the OK button in the dialog box reporting the number of replacements. Now select the Close button and finally press Alt plus F9 on your keyboard to hide the field codes. All your citations should now feature your new font style. To change the font style of an individual citation, select the entire citation, right-click it, and then select Font from the shortcut menu. Next, select your new font style from the Font dialog box. The options are the same as those we walked through in the previous section. When you're finished, select the OK button. The individual citation should be changed to your new font style. And as always, remember to save your file to save your changes. For more Microsoft Word tutorials, please see my playlist, How to Use Microsoft Word, where you'll find many related videos such as how to create a citation with multiple sources in Microsoft Word and how to add heading numbers to table titles and figure captions in Microsoft Word. All the resources mentioned today are linked in the description box below along with my website erinwritewriting.com which shows all the steps we just performed with images. Feel free to leave me a comment if there's a specific topic that you'd like me to talk about in the future. And please subscribe to my channel so you don't miss upcoming tutorials. 
and give this video a thumbs up if you found it helpful. Thank you so much for watching.